positive about the future because uh, I, I see work coming back over uh, from overseas, you know, first and foremost. Uh, I think manufacturing is in a very good spot the next 10 years in our economy. Um, I, I feel that people that are in strong financial positions like ourselves uh, have a lot of opportunity for growth. So yeah, I think this is a great time to be a plastics injection worker. Twenty twenty two was a fantastic year for us. Um, coming out of COVID was great because there were a lot of different things employee wise we could do and you realize how negative the whole COVID thing impacted us. So I think there's a rejuvenated energy. We had record sales and profits and um, a lot of new work and growing and have just completed another new facility in our campus. So we have three facilities now, so looking forward to filling that up with our first machine coming in in uh, late January. 2022 was a great year. Um, we had our best year as far as profitability wise. Um, the year for sales did much better than 2021. Um, we started the year out a little bit soft just coming out of COVID and the market dynamics with inventory pinched, but as the year went on, um, we were able to pivot, get into some new markets, and ended the year great. It was another year of tremendous growth, um, you know, thanks to our customers, thanks to our new customers. Um, thankful for the people in the area, we've been able to expand our team um, enough to grow with how steep the trajectory that we have going. Um, we're always, you know, we probably have hundreds of products under development that we're actively launching. Um, and obviously our employees like the products that we make because they span a ton of different segments. They're not just making one thing or the same thing every day. They get to go out on the weekend and they get to see their products that are either for sale or a part of the equipment that they use on a daily basis, for example. Yeah, I'd say 2022, I would probably summarize it into one word, which would be growth. And that growth would be a multifaceted growth. It would be a growth with some very significant customers. It would be growth around investing in new equipment. And it would be growth around investing in our people and our community. And I think when you put all those things together, it really packages up to a really great 2022.